Hi everyone, hello and welcome to Happy Saturday Dollar Tree Haul. I am here, we are back together and I am always so grateful, thankful and blessed to be here with every single one of you. I hope you all have had the most amazing couple of days since I saw you last on Happy Wednesday Dollar Tree Haul. Can't wait to jump in, share and show you all the great things that we found over the last few. So I do wanna get started right away. I do have two things that are $1.50 a piece and I will show those to you right now and then everything else in this haul is $1.25 a piece. So here we go. I found a box of monthly planners but they are so much more than that and I can't wait to share it with you so this is just beautifully done absolutely stunningly beautifully done they are so much more inside and I will flip to that in just a moment this is 2025 to 2026 be joyful monthly planner and then on the inside we have the belongs to page with some emergency contact information we have all of the days of the year for both of them right in the front and notice that it's all highlighted in pink here we have the monthly layouts absolutely grand and fancy then on the back we have a section for notes that gives us a couple of pages for that we also have these two pages which give us more uh gives us more room for contacts name and addresses and then right here this says scriptures to remember and reflections and then blessings and gratitude, blessings and gratitude. And over here, I will read you this side. It says, blessed are the pure in heart for they shall see God. Isn't that absolutely beautiful? And then lastly, lastly, my little sweetie peeties, we have the side which says my prayers. I think that that is just amazing. They did a stellar job on these and I'm very happy for them. So picked that up. Then I found this one, which is pertaining to amazing grace. Beautiful. I love all the polka dot styles. Very, very good quality as well. And then this layout is exactly the same, but it's like this teal green. And I think that this is really pretty as well. So I picked this one up too. I picked up one for my mom and one for myself and I love them both. So there is that right out the gate. Now let's move into the 125 stuff. Now, woo, I found some really jazzy, fresh, beautiful new deodorants that I've never seen before. This says PS Clean Beauty Hydrating Deodorant Spring, uh, spring Water. This is sulfate free, paraben free, dye free, fully free, cruelty free and vegan. And they are all 1.7 ounces. They're also made in the USA. And I think that they smell absolutely incredible. Every single one, I popped all of their tops and good, took a good sniff of each. And they have a very beautiful, beautiful fragrance. And so here is this one. This one here, this is nourishing deodorant coconut and shea butter oh that is just so jazzy and it smells incredible but this one this one is my absolute favorite this one here is green tea and cucumber daily detox deodorant so i am more than excited to have found those when i go to tj maxx and marshall's i usually find deodorant that is very similar to that packaging of different brands and they're usually about 5.99 to 6.99 for a deodorant so i scoop de duped those right up yes i did then in the seabrook new hampshire dollar tree because i can't remember where i got that first stuff from but these two were right up by the register and i noticed the minute that i picked up these two spiral little game books that they they are dry erase so these are gonna last forever in a day and I think that that is great so this is travel activity book and it says fun travel uh, fun travel games to make the miles fly by and it comes with the dry erase marker right up there I looked through both of the options of booklets to make sure that they were not the same and they are not each one has totally different games inside to play and use while you're on a road trip and then you can erase it and do it again the next time. So I loved all of them. They were spectacular and so exciting to put in the car for the little people. You know what? For the big people too, because if I'm riding shotgun, then that means that I am either scrolling on my phone, having a nice long chat or doing some form of like puzzles and you know game related things we even still do like license plate counting to see how many states for this state and that state that pass us on the highway so there is that and then right here we have these 
these games inside of there. There's bingo, swimming, scramble. I mean, just lots of fun, great stuff. Hey, there's license plate scavenger hunt right there, which is so exceptional. Dots and boxes. And I just love them. Every single page, front and back, upside down and right side up. So very, very cool and cute. And I thought that that was grand and fancy. You can even find some dry erase colored markers to color in those back sheets in some of those pages that give us pictures too. So what, what to that? That's really fun. Now I found these two things in the party section. Yes, I did. And I picked them up for crafting reasons. Now this is balloon glue. I also found um, this whole entire setup that you could make like a balloon arch and everything. But I picked up the dots so that I could make scrapbooks, cards and whatnot. This is 100 pieces of balloon glue. And they give you like all of the little sticky tabs in there to pull off and use for dots of glue. So I picked up two boxes, $2.50. That's 200 of them. So I'm gonna be sticking lots of things all over the place with those. And I thought that that was groovy. Now, okie dokie, I found lanyards. I did find four of them, but I picked up the two that absolutely spoke to me. So this is 22 inches and I love lanyards. I absolutely do. I love them so much that when I had a jewelry line that I was, you know, making and selling for quite a few years, I made a lot of lanyards. So this is a beautiful design. I love the orange, the white flowers, and the little pink centers. Comes with the key ring right there and the little clasp and a little uh, snap clip so that you can unhook it and then click it back in so that you can wear it. So perfect for badges, keys, and whatnot. This one is my favorite because I love the tie-dye smiley faces on it. So that's really fun, beautiful, awesome. Teachers, kids, everything. Wear them and keep your stuff all together on your person. And that, you know, gives me a lot less anxiety to know where my things are at all times. So loved that very much. Now, speaking of back to school, I mean, they have out cardboard stands of beautiful hair accessories that are just amazing for back to school options for you to pick up for the kiddos. Now, these are gorgeous hair clips, really fun, 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 beautiful styles. And this is a jaw clip for six plus age. That's what it says. But it has these really pretty butterflies on it. The flowers that are pink and yellow and a little bit of orange in there in some parts too. No, there's no orange. I'm colorblind. It was obviously just reflecting light. But they're a good size as well. And these are very, very pretty, nice clips. So I picked that up. And then this one, which is really so pretty with those really nice purple, blue, and pink color combination of flowers. So very, very stylish, fun, and jazzy. Picked that up right away. And then to get my hair up really super duper high, I picked up this nice fuchsia one. This beautiful, gorgeous fuchsia clip. I love the shape of it. The shape of it is just exceptional. I think it's really just so stylish and jazzy. And I hike up my hair in the back. Um, this is just a regular like twist bun. But when I really want to whip it up there, I put that clip in the back and just set it to the sky set it to the sky because I like my hair high and proud. <laughs> so I picked that up too and I love that color a lot. Now I found these two brush brush styles on the same exact cardboard setup. This is a brush and that's all it says. It says brush but it's really pretty and it's nice and small so you can fit it right inside of your backpack and use it to brush your hair as you're going through the school day if you wear your hair down. So Thought that that was just nice to have on hand for my purse, my backpack. Throw that right in my Ninja Turtle backpack that I just hauled for you guys the other day. And then here's a nice comb. And that's a fun metallic style comb. So there's that. And then it comes down into a point. So that's good for separating too if you're going to do braids or something like that. And it's just beautiful and nice. So I picked that up as well. Excuse moi, I have to bend a pinch because things get away from me around here when I whack them and hit them all over the place. Now, these are hair ties. These are 10 hair ties that are very, very nice quality and nice and stretchy as well. So loop-de-doop that hair and keep it out of your face. 
put a nice braid in your hair and a colorful little elastic right down at the bottom. And they're a nice material. They're a nice soft silky material. So they should slide out of your hair easily. Hopefully not too much breakage. Just be careful of that. So there is that as well. Now, oh my Lanta, oh my Lanta. I loved these clips. I certainly did love these clips. Yes, I did. And these are so pretty so beautifully pretty with this little beaded design coming down from the clips i mean that's just gorgeous i love the little stars i think the little stars are just so magical and precious in the pink and the gold so those are beautiful beautiful clips and i've never seen them do that style before in a hair clip then we have these hair clips and I love the crocheted flowers. I've seen these come out before in other colors and other styles and on other um, design patterns when they've put out hair accessories, but these are just so pretty light and pastel looking and I love them a lot. So those will look really cute in your hair and crochet is in, it's been in and I hope it doesn't go nowhere because I really enjoy all the crocheted things that are coming out and have been coming out for the last couple of years. So I found this nail art in the Ioni brand and I wanted to pick it up because I've been having a lot of fun using my Ioni nail um, designs and things like that, stickers and whatnot. This though is uh, nail art jewels and this is salon quality jewels easily transforms your nails to a dazzling effect at home. There are three charms in here and this is called extra. I love, you know, I love the boxes on Ioni products. They're just so beautiful, but look at their little smiley faces and they have bows on their head. And that is just too beautiful. I loved it. And it was off the side of where these hair accessories were. And it just paired so well with this style. So this is Nail Club. And it shows you that you do need glue for it. It shows you to apply it with a tweezer. And then put a coating over it. Like a hard, a hardener over it. To seal it to your nail. So I thought that that was just lovely. I just thought it was a lot of fun. So I scooped it up. And I will be brave enough to put that on my nails at some point when I'm not working and maybe on a vacation. And then right here, I found this headband and I loved it. I thought the ruching was beautiful. That gorgeous, vibrant, beautiful pink is so nice. And it's a super duper soft, wonderful quality. The little label in here says handmade. And I thought it was really pretty. So I picked that up as well. And then this one, this one with the pretty, pretty florals. And I love the color combination that they did with this particular one as well. And that fancy little um, gathering right at the top. I love a good bunch or a top knot at the top of my headbands. I just think it's so much fun. And then I found these kitty ears and they had two different styles to choose out of. But I just loved these and I loved the pink and the encrusted like glitter on it. I just thought that they were really fun and I could be a pink kitty for Halloween so I picked these up and that's like a metal band covered with a silky material over the headband style so grabbed those but the other um ha, uh, the other kitty ears were just as cute as well they really were so preciously adorable so picked those up too now I want to show you this and this is kind of just like silly and cutesy tootsy but I have a friend that really loves to go out for sushi so much it's like their pleasure to do and I found these two things and I just had to pick them up because they're just going to be cute little gag gifts now this is Amos brand right here and these are sushi gummies um four pieces and that is just too cute now when they come out with these I generally don't eat them but they came out with um I believe it was uh over like the uh, beginning of the springtime, they came out with a line that had like pickles in it and all a bunch of different type of like cookout style gummies. And I thought that they were adorably fabulous and I gave them away to somebody that was having a cookout. This is the sushi one. So the sushi looks pretty fancy. Look, it does. It looks pretty fancy and nifty. Now I'm only a girl that's going to eat a California roll. I can tell you that I want it cooked. I want it cooked. So California roll is usually what I go for if I'm going to do anything related to sushi. And then I found these erasers right here. So this is 3D erasers, five count. 
and these are just adorable as well absolutely adorable so cute and for anybody and everybody that likes to do like the mini brands and things like that these are so cute for that style of collecting the little food items and cutesy tootsie if you ask me so fun you can erase with them if you'd like but i would never i'm probably just going to use these for my doll houses when i make them to put them on the kitchen tables that i set up in the doll houses now this one is like cookout style there's a little pizza a drink there's french fries and there is a cute little hot dog and a bun and a hamburger that is just so so adorable i can't take the cuteness for real so grabbed that up yes i did now okie dokie then i did find some jazzy socks i found some wonderfully wonderfully great socks here now this is bum equipment men's two-pack liners cushion sole arch support breathability and it's a shoe uh shoe size 6 to 12 6 to 12 and i like that navy blue color they're very soft they're very very nice quality very soft so i got those for richie and then right here i picked these up for him as well this is the bum equipment men's these are quarter length and they're fashion uh cushioned sole arch support breathability and again they're a size 6 to 12 and i like the color combination on them so great socks and i haven't bought him like just regular everyday wear socks in a while because they're always like some form of like a fancy sock for work and you know his fun style that he collects so i'm very happy to give those to him when he gets home from work today and then my little sweethearts i did find some stuff to build a beautiful little gift set um the start of a beautiful little back to school gift set for my boy and my beautiful little teeny tiny tinker top boy that i love hi baby um i found these tins in the spider-man so right here this is the tin box company as we've been finding for months now randomly here and there and these are perfect for back to school absolutely perfect tins for back to school so we have spider-man in that style then we have web slinging time right here and doesn't he look like he is just in action he is action jackson over there so picked this one up too and i loved it so i grabbed that up and then this one i have to say would be my favorite of the three tins and it's just really really fancy and nice very bright vibrant and red and i always love that red color so vibrant so i picked that up then i have this and i found this wonderful cup and I don't know about in your Dollar Trees, but we have an abundance of these left of so many different themes. So I was very happy to find a Spider-Man one when I rummaged through. This is that brand right there, that Zach. And you can find that brand other places as well. But that's nice for a lunchbox, for a little lunchbox. And I think it would fit in there quite well. This is the little spout that you can drink out of. It just folds in and then pop it out with that little tab right there. Has a little loop right here to carry it if need be. And it's wonderful and has all the Spider-Man characters on it. So I picked this up. This is Spidey Amazing Friends from Marvel. Let's see on the bottom what it says. It says bottle, but it doesn't give an exact um, measurement line to how many fluid ounces it is i can't see it on here anyways it's bpa free as well so i picked that up to go with the spider-man back to school line then i found this that then yes certainly i did find this wonderful spiral notebook and it's a wonderful theme as well so i picked this one up and um it's a great size it's a great size it would fit right in a binder has the three hole punch right here to go in a beautiful little binder and all the great line pages to do your school work on so i snatched that right up then i picked up some fun stuff because i wanted to do the back to school stuff but also give him some other things to play with afterwards this is marvel spider-man nine 3d stickers and look at how fun they are they are nice puffy cool and they look like spider-man is going to hang out with you He's in a good form and uh, fashion the way that he's posing in every single shot. 
So I thought that that would be fun. He could even get a binder and plaster those on it and take it to school. And then right here, I picked this up for him for after school one day. So paint your own art board set. Marvel Spider-Man. And this one is create your own artwork. There's one piece in here. So it has this nice canvas with that image on it. And then it gives you these five different paint colors and a paintbrush inside of it. So that's just a nice little back to school moment so that when you come home, you do your homework and then you can sit, have a moment to craft, create and relax after a long school day. So I picked that up as well. And then okie dokie, I got some books. I did get some books and I'm pretty happy about every single one of them. I think that they're lovely. All American Dogs, A History of Presidential Pets from Every Era. That's what it says. So that is a nice, thick, big, hardcover book. This book went for $23.99. $23.99. An Extraordinary History of American Presidents and Their Best Friends. So that is so cool. And I love doggies. I love doggies. I love kitties. I love animals of every single uh, kind. I just worship animals, but every page is chock full of information as well as the pets and the president uh, and the presidencies that have gone through the USA all the way back to this time. And I thought that that was just fun, amazing and wonderful to rummage through if you like doggies and you want a proud moment of the USA to put that out during one of the independence um, holidays. So I thought that that was groovy. Then right here, I found this book and isn't Bob the most adorable thing you've ever seen? This right here is The Little Book of Bob, an inspirational phenomenon, life lessons from Streetwise Cat. So cute, this is a hardcover as well. This went for $24.99, and that's not a very big book, but outside of the Dollar Tree, that's how much it went for. It says, from the New York Times best-selling author of A Secret Cat Named Bob, comes an uplifting book of wisdom and advice from the most street-savvy cat of all. And it goes on from there for all of the other information. So a nice little read. If you like kitties, I think that this is so special. And I can't wait to read it myself, to be honest with you. So grab this, and I can't wait to dive into that book. And then this one looks really cute, too. So this says, so here's the thing. Notes on growing up, getting older, and trusting your gut. And you know what? Sometimes that's a really exceptional lesson to learn. This went for $27, $27 for that particular one. And so here's the thing. Her name is Alyssa is back with a bold, no nonsense, no holes barred 21st century girl's guide to life, tackling the highs and lows of the body politics, relationships, education, life on the internet, pop culture and spontaneous motorcycle trips along the Japanese coast. I mean, that is a lot of info. She's about to teach us some stuff, wouldn't you say? So, so I think that this is going to be a fun, fancy read, and it will definitely teach me something. And then lastly, I found this from my mom. I found this from my mom, um, the winner of the Pulitzer uh, Pulitzer Prize, The Hope of Glory, Reflections on the Last Words of Jesus from the Cross. So I picked this up from mom. This is so super, super great from my mom. And the beautiful image inside of the front right there. Then we have that gorgeous image on the back side and then all of the information inside. And um, this is just our religious belief. So this is something for us. And that is what I got from mom. Now this went for $22, $22 originally. And this is also a hardcover book. So I loved it. I thought it was great and I couldn't wait to pick it up for mom. And I'm pretty excited to gift that to her. So that is it. That is it. Happy, happy Saturday Dollar Tree haul. I love you guys to the moon and the stars in the sky. I hope everybody is doing exceptionally well. Thank you guys so much for being here with me. It has been a long week. It has been a long week. Um, and I am definitely ready for the weekend. I don't know about you, but I'm ready for it. And the heat has been getting to me. It really has been getting to me. So 
after I'm done the haul, I'm going to go and I'm going to get into something that is cool and relaxed. I mean, it looks like it's cool over here, but I got a tie dye little dress on and it's still too much because it's muggy as anything. I've never felt such muggy weather in my life than this summer. It is consistent. It is being very consistent. So I'm going to refresh myself and I hope everybody is doing well, is safe in this heat if you are dealing with it as well i love you guys be careful out there if you have to go out and about protect yourself and shade yourself as much as possible hydrate yourself and all the things and i will see you guys on happy monday dollar tree haul and hey if you're new here hi i'm callan i would love it if you'd stick around stay like share subscribe comment down below hit the bell notification so that you are aware of every single time that i upload a new video here on this channel i do dollar tree hauls on saturdays mondays and wednesdays i'm so happy to do it with you guys and thank you for joining me and being here with me to do all of these wonderful things and see all of these wonderful things with your friend over here so i will see you soon have a beautiful blessed one i love all you beautiful faces bye everyone